Hello once again fans, how y'all doing? This is another sports update for you. Um, the Packers, the Green Bay Packers, they surprised me last week. They, they dominated. They, um, they came out strong. Once again, um, Aaron Rodgers did not play, but Eddie Lacy dominated the running game. Nine carries for 45 yards and a touchdown. He was running strong, running hard and strong. And um, Brett Hundley started uh, at quarterback, five out of seven, 67 yards. He was looking strong until he got injured and they had to take him out. Joe Callahan came in, but you know, and again, this wasn't much of a passing game. I mean, Brett did great, but, and again, Joey, he had a subpar game, and, uh, but overall, Eddie Lacy, uh, in the running game, James Starks, John Crockett dominated, John got a touchdown, um, as well as Eddie Lacy, that's for their two touchdowns, and, uh, our, our, our defense pretty well, uh, maintained Derek Carr, he was, I mean, 9 out of 13, he, he played almost the first half, I believe. I don't recall exactly, but... And, um, still, with our backups, we still dominated the first half. That game, it was like... It was 7-3 to three at halftime, but we dominated because they, they had their starting quarterback in there. And he's, you know, he's coming on strong from last year, but... Again, we, uh, we held him in check for the most part. Only 38 yards out of 9 completions. And an interception. Which was a tremendous over the, over the shoulder catch. He bobbed it up and one of our, like, young cornerbacks overtook, uh, Cooper. And just, you know, <laughs> freaking Amari Cooper, he just took it away. But he just jumped up like he was a receiver. Freaking Amari Cooper just stood there like, oh, what? He's all he was like, Almost, I don't know if he was rookie of the later year last year, but he's he's coming on strong from college, and he had a great year last year, and he just our guy just went up and took it away from him. It's like you know, it's awesome, it's awesome play. So uh, that's what I think about that. Green Bay dominated, they scored another ten points in the third quarter, and another three to finish the game, twenty to twelve. They won. I thought it was going to be an nail biter, but. I didn't get it right, and uh, Green Bay did win. Now, for the matchup, I've been waiting for it. Green Bay at San Francisco. And finally, from what I've he been hearing, that Aaron Rodgers is finally going to play in a preseason game. This is great news to get him some reps, competitions, and uh, see how he does. But, San San Francisco, and I believe as far as I know, Terry Kavanagh is going to play in this upcoming game, but that will not make a difference. Uh, Green Bay is just a stronger team here, and... Um, I just don't see, I don't see San Francisco staff from Green Bay here at all. They just don't really have the, uh, they actually got Christian Ponder, he used to play for Minnesota. He might even win over the starting job there for, you know, he was 7 out of 8, 86 yards last week on a touchdown, but against Denver. But, I think uh, Green Bay is going to dominate this game from the get-go. Be up 14-17-3 or 17-7 at half. I believe Aaron Rodgers is going to put a strong quarter in. I think he'll play at least a quarter. And uh, Green Bay is going to dominate from the get-go. And the second and third stringers are going to just hang, hang on for the win. Uh, Green Bay up three... Three wins, zero loss, I believe, after this one. Um, they're not able to 
play five games this year, which they could have if um, they didn't cancel the Hall of Fame game, but they did, so they're only going to play four. But, I just, I don't see San Francisco winning this game, even though it's at their home field. Uh, Green Bay, all over on this one. Go Aaron Rodgers, Green Bay Packers. Gonna get this one in a dominating fashion. Josh, signing off for now. That's your recap, recap of last week and the prediction for this upcoming week. Josh, signing off for now. Stay tuned for more sports updates and other videos. Music, entertainment, sports, live streaming, gaming, and all sorts of other kinds of videos. Take care, y'all. Peace. Take care.